Hello guys, it's uh, me. I know it's been a while uh, since I posted a video, so I wanted to uh, give an update on a couple things. Um, what you're looking at here is basically my new snail tank that uh, I kind of um, <clears throat> started started uh, breeding them. So I wanted to give you a, a kind of a look and then I'll show you some other things like how, you see all those little white dots? <clears throat> Yeah, those are snails. They look kind of like, I don't know, like maggots maybe, or like a little, just little flecks, little dots. You can see there's quite a few of them. But yeah, my snails in my other uh, aquarium started laying these eggs and I actually wound up with maybe 30 of them in my other tank and I just let them go and they grew to adulthood. So I was like, well, what the heck am I going to do with all these snails? I actually went to my local pet store um, who specialize in a lot of fish and I actually sell them now. So that's a tip too to you know maybe if you guys want to start doing this start calling around to your local fish stores and uh see if they'll take them because you know what i got a pretty good deal i feel for them especially when you see how many hatch uh so nothing special in this it's just some water from one of my other tanks uh, i did put the um this is pothos uh, pothos plant that you know they get the long tendrils and the reason I put it in there is because I've noticed uh, you know I like first of all I like the way it looks and second of all I found out that the snails actually eat pothos um, it hasn't seemed to kill them or anything so I'm imagining it's you know a good part of their diet kind of this um, you know when it starts getting I guess rotting or whatever the kind of the vegetation uh, is good for them and these now are about maybe two weeks old but what I wanted to show you um, here maybe in another video um, is how I actually hatch them um, and we'll put some more in this tank I think uh, one of the uh, egg uh, clutches is ready to go so I just wanted to show you uh, this real quick um, we'll come back to it let me uh, uh, set up and get um, you know go get the other video and everything I mean the other uh, I'm gonna go get my hatchery and uh, we'll get a clutch in there and we'll we'll dump some new snails in there and, and I'll kind of show you what it's like uh, the stuff on the ground here um, <clears throat> it's a piece of calcium or um, I forget exactly what it's called um, but you get them for like you know birds parakeets in the in the pet store and basically it's calcium to help out their shells. I kind of carve some of it off like like with a knife to make dust and then just kind of spread it in there and then leave that big chunk in there and it'll eventually sink. And I've heard it's just good for their shell, the calcium, you know, it makes sense to me, uh, you know. Uh, and then also that uh, other stuff is, is uh, food. Um, I have these little shrimp pellets uh, that I might show you here in a second too when I upload the other video. Um, that they seem to like they love these things. They seem to like them more than algae wafers And I think that might be part of why I have such great success with these guys. I'll sh I should show you some of the other ones I have um, They're quite large um, I Actually have a tank at work too that I'll have to show you guys um, But let me end this video now uh, I'll get set up for you know to uh, show you the hatchery and um We'll talk uh, here in a little bit. Don't forget to like this if you guys, you know, want to see more videos. Um, I, I start, you know, I started this new channel uh, to see, you know, if there's interest in it and if you guys are more interested in this. If you have any questions, anything, you know, let me know. Uh, I'll see if I can figure it out or, or help you guys out too. Um, don't forget to like and uh, subscribe. All right, talk to you later.